Hi, I'm Sean Gannon, and this is Minute Math, and today we're going to learn about dividing polynomials. If I was given this polynomial to divide, n squared minus n minus 29 divided by <clears throat> n minus 6, okay? Well, what we're going to do is our long division here. So I'm going to take my n minus 6, and I'm going to see how it can go into n squared minus n minus 29. Okay, I made it a little longer than I needed to. Okay, so I'm going to ask the question, what times n gives me n squared? So what times n gives me n squared? Pretty simple, that's just an n, right? n times n is n squared. So I'm going to put n over my n value right there, so keep it in the line. n times n is n squared. And then n times a minus 6 is a minus 6n. Then we have to subtract these two. Okay, I'm already subtracting the whole parentheses, right? The whole part. All right, so when I subtract that n squared minus n squared is just a zero, great, eliminates that. Minus n minus a negative 6n is the same thing as adding a 6n, right? Add, so minus n plus a positive 6n, right, we can screw that. That comes out to be OA5n, okay? And if you need to see it, you can distribute this minus sign across like that. Uh, makes it easier. You can see minus n plus 6n is 5n. We bring down our minus 29, and we do it again. We say, okay, what times n gives me 5n? Well, hmm, that's just 5, right? So we have plus 5. 5 times n gives me 5n, so we have 5n here. And the 5 times a minus 6 multiplied to the other thing, uh, the number there is a minus 30. And again, we need to subtract these two values. We subtract them. 5n minus 5n is just 0. Great. But negative 29 minus a negative 30, if you need to distribute this minus sign to all parts, it's easier, okay? You can see how it is subtracted there. Minus 29 plus 30 is just a 1, positive 1. And that is our remainder. So when we write our final answer, we have n plus 5 plus our remainder over our uh, what we're dividing by here, n minus 6. And there we have it. We have our final answer of n plus 5 plus 1 over n minus 6. So let's recap. We're given n squared minus n minus 29 is divided by n minus 6. We do our long division here. We see, okay, how many times, uh, what times n gives me n squared, which is just n. Multiply that out to both parts and subtract it. Then we had, okay, 5n here. What times n gives me 5n? That was a positive 5. Did the same thing, multiplied it out. Then uh, we subtracted them, giving me a uh, one is my final answer here, or I have a remainder after the uh, dividing. So we have a remainder of one. So then we just have our final answer up top here, that n plus five, which is right there, plus one over n minus six.